Did you hear about the attempt to build the Death Star? Well, it's not over. Here's where things are at. On November 14, 2012, a patriot known as J.D. from Longmont, Colorado, posted a petition to the White House's official We the People website, citing a need for increased space superiority and job creation. J.D. requested that the government secure resources and funding to begin construction of a Death Star by 2016. The petition needed to reach only 25,000 signatures over a span of 30 days in order to receive an official White House response. Well, word made its way around, as it does, yet with only five days remaining and still thousands of signatures short of reaching its goal, the petition soon became apparent on Reddit, where it received approximately over 9,000 upvotes. A little over 7,000 to be exact. But it wasn't enough. A day later and closer to the end of a lost cause, Fox News picked up the story on TV. And while Fox found humor in the petition, they reported that it stood, quote, little chance of reaching President Obama's desk because it still needed 11,700 signatures. And with only four days left to do so, things looked grim. But word of the Death Star proposal kept on spreading, and by the time the clock was up, the petition had received over 34,000 signatures, well beyond the required threshold. And so, as promised, the official White House responded. Paul Shawcross, the chief of the Science and Space Branch at the White House Office of Management and Budget, warned that because the Death Star would cost over $85 quadrillion, the government couldn't reconcile spending that much taxpayer money. That and the administration didn't support blowing up planets. The Department of Petitions also responded by increasing the number of signatures needed to 100,000. After U.S. tax fund rejection, the effort expanded to the greater Earth, wherein we must take planetary defense into our own hands. The open source Death Star Kickstarter campaign has raised over $300,000, but with a rival Kickstarter campaign attempting to fund an X-Wing squadron to combat the Kickstarter campaign to fund a Death Star, some wonder if it's worth trying to get a Death Star built after all. We here at Rocket Boom say do or do not. No try there is. And Kegan, and this is Rocket Boom I am.